The other guy I wanted to talk about, John McTiernan. Ooh. We mentioned he was a legend by the time this film came out, right? He would go from the absolute highest peak of filmmaking to one of the most spectacular falls from grace in probably the history of Hollywood, right? With some pretty wacky stuff. Unbelievable. So he makes, in a row, Predator, Die Hard, Hunt for Red October. Just three bangers, yeah. right? Three amazing movies. All three of those are classics. Mm -hmm. He has a couple stinkers in there. Last Action Hero, eh, you know. Mm -hmm. eh. He did a movie with Sean Connery called Medicine Man. Eh, not very good. But then he makes Die Hard with a Vengeance. That's pretty good. Unfortunately for McTiernan, it was all downhill after this film came out in 1999. He had a very uneven year, to say the least. The Thomas Crown Affair would be the last quality film that he ever made. Just three weeks later, another film that he mostly directed was released called The 13th Warrior. That's a pretty bad film. 